Hello YouTube. So in today's Cubase quick tip, I'm going to take one entire unit of drum MIDI programming and I'm going to extract each individual drum sample, which is uh, on its own um, pitch on, in this case. We're going to extract each individual one and put them into their own respective uh, events and their own respective tracks. So we're going to go from this single track of drum programming to what you see here. All right, so what you wanna do is highlight the events that you're trying to dissolve the parts from. And on a PC, you would hit the control button and then right click. On a Mac, you hit uh, command and then right click. And go down to this MIDI uh, sub menu here and click on dissolve part now this menu comes up you have the option to dissolve to lanes instead of new tracks uh, so you can go ahead and click that if you like uh, I'll demonstrate here it is it opens up the lanes menu and then it drops each individual part into a lane now I don't like using this because I can't rename these individual tracks and it kind of just confuses me so what I do instead is go to dissolve part and not select the dissolve lanes and I also uncheck the optimized display. Now if I didn't uncheck that, sometimes these events like to resize and some of them go uh, further out than they're supposed to and some of these are chopped up into little bits and I don't like doing that. Um, so that's why I go with the lanes because now I can rename any of these and I uncheck the optimized because then it keeps all of the events the same size as the event that you're dissolving the parts from. Um, also no worth noting is the event that we've dissolved the parts from is now muted. So you can you can always unmute it if you want but it's it's already uh, muted and it's good because if it didn't do that then you would have two you would have twice the exact same part, so it'd be playing twice over, and you don't want to, you don't want to have that. So hopefully that helps you. Um, you might want to be dissolving parts for other reasons other than um, drum MIDI programming, but I see this as the most immediate reason why you would want to dissolve the parts in that way. So leave a like if you like this video. Uh, leave a comment. Maybe just mention if uh, if you do use this for some other reason that. Uh, is worth noting then leave a comment and let me know what you're doing and uh, thanks for watching and take care bye bye